Welcome, I'm Hawaiian Shirt Papa. Sometimes with others, I visit a variety of antique, vintage, and thrift shops within Southern Ontario. Sometimes we don't get anything. Come tour with me vicariously. Hello and welcome to another tour by Hawaiian Shirt Papa. This time it's a society shop of the St. Vincent de Paul Society. This one's in Essex. I thought this was a good sign to start with. So here we are starting near the front window by the door. And you end up in the showcase and the, the cash area. But now we're going to head off into the hard goods. These are uh, towards the middle of the store where it's narrower. So there's two aisles that connect from the rear, the rearmost portion of the store to the front portion of the store. And that's where the hard goods are located. The rear portion has the furniture and other hard, larger items. Framed art, unframed art. We actually picked up a, a frame and a print. The print was just interesting. Uh, it's kind of a theoretical couple of Hawaiian shirt wannabes, but no, they aren't. So they got to stay for somebody else's enjoyment. So here we are, There's a little statuary here, some furniture, some large items. Uh, sporting goods, small area. This is the overview of the clothing. This is not a small store, it's a substantial store here. They had um, some designers clothes in a variety of, a few colors and a whole selection of sizes. They were limiting anybody who want, was buying it to two of any one color. Then we found that they were selling the same things and a few others in the general region. So it must have been a fair sized donation from probably some co corporate donor statuary here. And again, the handbags, we take a look, but. Uh, vinyl in that case there's either they've got condition issues or they're just not a high value item so they end up staying uh, sometimes we find some higher end purses but like I said they often have some condition issues substantial enough that I won't take them on. Well, at the back they had the, f besides the framed frames and art and so on, they had the bicycles and furniture, as I said earlier. This is just another look at a different portion of it. And this is the very back of the uh, furniture area. Some of the items were uh, disassembled and hadn't been reassembled, whether or not they just received them or, or so, so. Otherwise, I don't know. The pillows, uh, 
to interesting collection. There are nice ones. And the books and DVDs and CDs were tucked into one corner. This is in that narrowed section. And near the front, opposite the cache, is this uh, costume jewelry display. It looks like it's locked, but it isn't. You can just pull the drawer outwards to, to have a closer examination. And nicely displayed. And right by the cache, there were some of these glass containers. Westwood Avenue did pick them up. Not all of them. In any case, I hope you enjoyed this tour. And I hope you also subscribe, give us a like, put a ding on the bell for notifications, and we'll see you at the next tour. Thanks again, folks. Bye-bye.